Word, hey guys. So this is something that came out actually this year, oh well last year, I'm, uh, it's 2020, I forget. Um, I I looked at it, I thought it was pretty cool. I don't see a lot of information about it, like, I don't know, it's like not a lot of the devs, I guess, came out and said stuff or whatever. Well, I guess we can read the readme kind of a thing and kind of get a uh, thing about this. So, uh, what is this? It's uh, Iron Fury, it's like a, uh, well, it's, that the the main kind of sell I I in my opinion is uh, it's like a old like build engine game like like you remember build engine build engine is like I, I was just doing Duke 3D like like a while ago that's that engine and this came out in 2019 so they they've obviously done a couple of changes here and things like that but I I, <laughs> I really like that actually so it's I, I you know what I, I guess it's a lot of nostalgia bait but fuck it I'm I'm for it um, I tried it a little bit and it seems pretty fun so. I, I, I like it a lot, so... Anyways... Um, my, I think my only gripe with it so far is, um... It's probably a little bit overpriced for what it is, maybe? I haven't gone through the entire thing, so I, I'll reserve that until the end. But, it's like, I think it was like $40 full price, maybe $30. I mean, this is also Canadian dollars, so it's like... Uh, everything's inflated there, kind of thing, so... That may be the other reason. <clears throat> but, you know... I, I mean, I'm willing to give it a try. I'll see if it, like it's worth that level of money. Because for, for most games, I think I'd spend like 20 bucks or something. But you know what? We'll reserve judgment. All right. Uh, that was just kind of like in my initial thoughts with this kind of thing. So, but I, I think it's also really fucking cool. So, you know, what? I mean, whatever. At the, at this point, if you probably played Duke Nukem like way back in the day, you probably have the money to <laughs> buy this kind of shit anyways. You're you're an adult or some other shit. So. But I, I kind of like it. So I kind of tried Maximum Fury out. Um, and it's actually, you die a lot and then uninstall the game. Thanks for playing. Uh, it is kind of difficult. I, I don't think it would be good for a blind run to do that. Because I haven't really, I've only just played a little bit at the beginning. I haven't played that much. I mean, this one's probably much better for me. Uh, tended for the experience for the average player and new players now. We're playing Ultra Viscara. I mean, come on, guys. It's pretty fucking cool. You're lucky I can't fit a grenade launcher in my bag. <laughs> I mean, come on. It's that's pretty fucking cool, isn't it? So I'm not too. I think I know a little bit. This is like a sort of a. What? Did someone try to kill me? Yeah. Well, I, I know they know I'm here, but you know, it is what it is. Oh, there's a secret here I honestly I think this is cool as shit to be honest the fact that they uh, there's a build engine that game that came out in fucking 2019 I'll probably say it multiple times is there a guy down there yeah I guess it was because he just died I can't drink the soda oh there's some shit over here This is, I, I, I'm not, like, it's already as it is, you can see, like, look how elaborate this shit is. Like, it's so, they, they actually made, like, an entire, like, world out of it already and stuff. But I just need a... So, I, I kind of read a little bit in the story, something about, like, some androids attacking. And so that's what, uh, sorry, that's what the right click does. It kind of, I, I kind of hold it upon their head. Guess I can't do it on him. So as far as I know, it's like it well it's kinda like an auto aim thing, I believe. It just takes a little bit longer to run a new shot. If that's if you actually want to do that, but uh, thankfully I can actually aim, so uh, which is words I will soon come to regret through montages. Uh, 
There's a Friends Arcade uh, kind of reference. I wonder if it's like a. Uh, oh yeah, you also get the. Nothing there. <laughs> get that. You get the noise whenever you're trying to. Oh, here we go. We got Blake Stone, uh, 3D Realms game. Vitaminist, not sure. I'm not sure about what that is, and I'm not sure about that one. I, I'm pretty sure the reference is to old games. What's this? Slam. Am I actually spending money on this? Oh. Oh, cool. You got Dick's secret stash. This is number. Sorry, Uzi Ben. That's kind of nice. Um, so what can we buy from this one? Am I out of money? <laughs> All right, so we're done making erotic noises. Okay, I, didn't, I had no idea what I was like. So it's just like kind of classic, like in, in terms of like just riddled with secrets. I guess it's really quite nice, actually. And now I have the prod. Oh, so I, I did get the key card, so I guess I can just continue. I want to try this easy though, it seems nice. That is a pretty close ship. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's some kind of incendiary runs. This is a public service announcement. Return to your homes or face death. We are taking over this town. Think again, asshole. I want to try milling something. Alright, maybe, maybe we won't do that. We're done when I say we're done. I just realized how many bullets are in this thing and how fast she's reloading it. I thought I was see, I was just up there for the secret. I I didn't actually see anything there. That's interesting. Alright, we're gonna open up the event. Okay, I guess we're not. Nuka Mall. I, I, I do enjoy the scattered little references everywhere. Oh, the trash is actually an object. Can we go into the health place? No. Cyber Elf. Oh. Good thing I have auto aim. All right, so take out the trash. <laughs> take out the trash, and I don't know. I, I think those are like armor shards. I didn't pay attention. <laughs> take it, baby. <laughs> nice. Take it, baby. <laughs> Even the ATM machines are very polite. Oh, there's cola. What else? <laughs> Nothing. You're gonna be hearing. Oh wait, but this should. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I knew it somehow. Portable med kit. Fix yourself up. Oh, you know what? There's probably a key for that, actually. I should probably look at that. I have not seen the keys at all. Okay, so... I just realized, though, there was an option here for auto-aim. I just turned it off. Uh, because I don't think I need it. Also, there's a, there's a third-person mode. I had no idea that was a thing. Um, I'm probably not going to play the entire game like this. Because it's also a little bit difficult. So we're going to go back to the first person. But just to let you know, there is. Oh, that's a highly desirable thing. Alright, never leave home without the Magnum. Oh, that's, that's the same place I was already at. Ah. I keep thinking those, those soda cans are drinkable things. Are they just respawning on me or what? That ain't cash money. You cannot deny the truth. That's all I see in the corner there. Nothing there. Yeah. Guess nothing here. Oh, dude, creamy stick. I'm down for that. Now, if these are supposed to be robot things, and they're not very good at aiming. Oh well. All right, I want to go into creamy stick. Uh, well, luckily it's all pixelated, so we, we can't tell what it is. It's a 
shame that we can't continue to use Uzi, though. Oh, this is from this place. Okay, I hadn't noticed the vent that was there before. Oblong's not wrong. Fat Earth Society. <laughs> They're like a... Let's, let's play with the electric outlet. Oh man, it actually hurts me. I mean, obviously it does. That's over here. More magazine. Oh no, there's a health pack. It's, it's a good thing because I was touching the electrical socket. Kind of need that. You know, I keep reloading this thing. What, what, what do you think I do with like the 70 other bullets that I, I kind of took in and out of that? Asking for a friend. Why can't I use these? Who's that? I can't take the Febreze. I mean, that honestly, actually, that looks like McNuggets, so never mind. You know, the kind of the problem I've kind of realized is that these guys don't actually appear to drop anything for me. Oh, yeah. But we I mean, oh yeah. Nothing there. Oh. I, I, okay, I guess it's just more erotic noises. Looks like I ambush? Yeah, I did. Still something around here. I guess I'll be back there in a minute. Oh, it's this guy, I wonder. This is my boomstick. <laughs> That's uh that's, oh, those are shotgun shells. What's the uh, alternate fire on this? I don't see an alternate fire. Right click doesn't really seem to do anything. You know, this is the most grenade launcher shotgun I've ever seen. And that's an actual grenade launcher. Well, we're kind of right fucked, aren't we? Ah, uh, no alcohol. All right, let's just kind of run after my thing. Oh, that guy had a shotgun too. That's not fair. Actually, it's totally fair. All right, we're kind of in a pickle. Well, I'm I'm just gonna go ahead and quick save it if that even works. I've been playing it like a cover shooter this entire time. All right, hopefully we can find some HP because as much as I like ten health, um, I don't really like ten health. But this is a nice weapon. Uh, it's like a oh, we've been here before. Can I pick up? No, I can't eat the McNuggies. Fuck. Alright. Well, now we have 9 health. I'm sorry. I don't know how I knew I had 9 health before I did that, but you know. It's just magical things I do. Actually, let's go back here and get the, the shotgun ammo. There you go. Hopefully it's not something I'm missing with uh, <laughs> some health guys. Let's go into the sewer. No time for a little swim. I think it's health right here. Hell yeah, 34. That's some armor here. You know, I just put on my underwater armor. All right, and we got more magnum rounds. I don't really know if there's anything else that's good here. Oh, actually I have a breathing meter, I just realized. It's kind of small given the high resolution of the game, so I, I didn't notice it the first time. But I did notice it the second time. Alright, what's in here? Oh, it's just a doorway over here. I'm down for that. Alright, we've been to that trash can. Yeah, it, it is kind of just... Yeah, it just spawn things after I've been in some of these areas, so... There you go, 59. Look, look, we're, we're nice and healthy again. 
We don't need to kick down the difficulty at, at all, you know? That's fine. Caco Bell? Oh, Caco Demons. The $5 Phobos Philip. Oh, yeah, that sounds good. I actually want to go into this bar. This does not look like a bar, but I guess we'll find out one way. There you go. Have a drink? Yeah, there you go. How, how long can I do this for? Is this costing actually money? Nothing there. <laughs> it just gives up after a little while. I think you're only supposed to go only only get so much health. Oh wait, oh okay. Thought that actually opened. Coffee shop. And winners don't use drugs. April 20th, 420. Damn good coffee and hot. Oh shit. So this is like a a long ass game. Like as in like they're not level to level. Mick Monster. Ten K calories for the true American. Santa fault. Uh, uh, that the, the, the salt salt and fat. And nothing wrong with a bit of salt and fat. They're being sniped, I think, by that. No, oh, no, that wasn't anything over there. Maybe it's that guy. What the fuck, dude? Putin machine. <laughs> How did you know my kill phrase? The reason I kind of can't run out just all willy nilly out in the open is because. One of the core enemies is hit scan, it looks like, so. You just automatically take the damage when you're running around here. Like that guy. Like, it's basically the first enemy you see, and they do a lot of damage, actually, so. You either have to be really good, or in my case, really careful. But I have to say, I like the feel of it so far. It's actually really fucking nice. I, it's just something about build engine games which are really fun. Alright, so we need a blue key, and obviously the blue key that we got from last mission did not carry over. Ah, oh, these ones don't do it. Washington 4 skins. <laughs> Alright, I like this. Alright, so there's another sewer down there, and what looks to that's a shotgun. Actually, I doubt I'm gonna be able to jump. No, no, there's no way. Well, I, I can find out if I can uh, tightrope walk. I can. Oh, this is kind. Of, this is quite pleasant, actually. And we got the yellow key card. Okay. Oh shit! What? I, I thought I heard Vader, but you know. Worthless consumer models. Oh, they just called me a flesh bag. Oh, that's, not, no, that's not nice. That's our word. <laughs> this is actually probably a really nice shotgun. Oh, I'm missing probably. Alright, I can't quite make it up there. I want to deal with the guy who's calling me a flesh bag. Domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. <laughs> <laughs> and she's got her own lines. Alright. Where's the guy calling me Fleshbag? I, I want to meet him. Could say I've got a stick up my ass. Sorry. There's no other weapons which I can make suitable puns with. Uh, I'll, I'll try up here first. Oh shit. Oh, that's the yellow key card. Okay. I do not believe I have 
a, a, a flashlight, so. But I have not finished exploring this place. This place is really large and elaborately designed. And I like it. Fire in the hole, assholes. <laughs> oh, this is a weapon. This is an ammo type switch. So I guess it does switch to an actual shotgun. Oh, sorry, it's, <laughs> it's a shotgun right now. Sorry, it switches to an actual grenade launcher. I feel like I should waste my ammo on something like a target. There's like goodies in every corner. Nah. Nah. Yeah, exactly. Well, I think we've pretty much explored everything, unless I want to try jumping over there. I, I can make that. I can totally make that. Whether or not I'm supposed to actually be there is another question. Okay, there's an actual invisible wall there, so... Because <laughs> I know I made that jump. Come on, devs, are you even trying? I still love your game, though. Alright. Well, there's some goodies over there. I just jumped from to the crate? I guess I do. Oh, there's like a, another item over here. Alright, some more armor. I just kicked the shit out of that guy. Anything in here? Knock knock. Please open up. I'll use the stun baton on low setting. <laughs> All right. I think we're gonna leave it up here, guys. So uh, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep doing this every day. So uh, I'm just having a blast with this. So let's uh, well, is that pun intended? I don't know. Uh, see you next time. Bye.